question I get every week. How can I get into the real estate investing business with no money and no real experience? God love you. Everybody's got to start somewhere and you have come to the right place. If you do your homework, I can help turn you into a very successful real estate investor. I'm Elise Glink. Here's today's Real Estate Minute. The best thing that you can do to get started as a real estate investor is to read everything you can find on the topic. So start off at thinklink.com where I have over, I think it's 12,000 pages of unique content with tons of real estate investing tips. You'll also be able to read tons of Q and A's from people just like you who are looking to get smarter about money. While some of what you read won't apply to your initial goals because it's for the people who are, you know, they've been doing this a while. The rest will help you form a base of knowledge about the very different way parts of this business work. Then you can start to put together a team of advisors who can help to mentor you. You'll want an attorney, a mortgage lender, a real estate agent, an accountant, uh, probably a home inspector or a commercial property inspector. That's just for starters. Once you have a basic understanding about how real estate investments work, It'll be time to make your first purchase. And I'd love for you to start with a personal residence because buying a place to live is gonna allow you to make a good investment on very reasonable terms. And you'll see firsthand how much it takes to find the right property, how much it takes to negotiate a reasonable offer, and for sure, how much it takes to close and move. And you'll also have a better understanding of costs and how they work in a real estate environment. But I want you to buy your personal residence with an eye towards turning it into your first investment property. And when you're ready to buy another, put in the time to really check out the market, even if it takes six months or a year. I've found it's better to wait to find the right deal than charge ahead, be hard charging, and buy just any old thing you trip over. Most importantly, what makes a great real estate investor, a lot of money, right, is knowing what your exit strategy is. So before you even make an offer, understand how you're going to get out of this property and who's going to buy it or rent it from you. I'm Elise Glink. If you want to learn more about investing in real estate, I really suggest you check out my Intentional Investor Series at thinklinkstore.com. Use the discount code buy now, and I'll give you a big break on the price. And be sure to visit my website, thinklink.com, sign up for my free weekly newsletter, and you'll see I'm working to rebuild America one house at a time. Thank you.